Red Rishi Mushroom Farm How to Grow Rishi Rishi Mushroom Harvest and Processing Mushroom Farm Mushrooms are mainly produced by fungi and people living across the world keep a great appetite to consume them. There are a variety of mushroom classifications consumed and grown throughout the world, but this video is about the red rishi mushroom. Biologically known as Ganoderma lucidum, famous as red rishi mushrooms have a bitter taste with no scientifically proven health benefits, but a few scientists claim that it has a slight effect on the immune system of living organisms. Similarly, the same scientists also quote that these mushrooms can be a great factor if used as herbal medicine to cure several diseases, including cancer, but without any proof. It grows on trees, on components that are affected by fungus, and mostly grows on dead and dying trees, such as oak, elm, beech, and maple. Similarly, these mushrooms prefer to grow in areas that come under hotter regions and humid climates, which is mostly found in Asian countries. Similarly, before the 1970s, it is grown naturally, but after, it was commercially grown in every continent of the world. This is why now there's a great focus to adopt red rishi as a commercial product, as it seems to be a lucrative item to be grown to earn from it. Furthermore, it does require some basic investment in the capital, such as land, but it depends on the bearing of the investor to choose whatever acres he wants. The buyers of these mushrooms are the pharmaceutical companies that are selling herbal medicines in the medicinal industry as discussed above, because it's mostly used in medicines to cure the above-mentioned diseases. While glancing over the mushroom industry, you'll come to know that the annual valuation of the mushroom industry is said to be $50.4 billion in 2021 and is expected to have a rampant growth in the upcoming years. So it won't be a bad investment in mushrooms if you do intend to do it after completely watching the video. How it grows. Unlike other vegetables and fruits, check out the channel for more. So yes, unlike the other vegetables and fruits, reishi mushrooms demand more warmth than humidity. Initially, the farmers are supposed to cut fresh logs from the woods discussed above as oak, elm, beech, maple, or any other trees that bestow sweet fruits. After cutting the trees, their log must be rested for two weeks, and at the same time, these must be protected from getting dry. Now, if the logs are ready, these must be drilled, and one log can bear the growth of 50 mushrooms. Now the drilled logs are filled with wax by the farmers and sealed for a certain duration of time. Hot wax works much better and saves time. After the logs are waxed, they must be kept in shady areas protected from sun and wind, but the farmers should be very conscious about the drying out of the logs. This is why it's suggested water must be sprinkled at least once a week on them. This is done to ensure the humidity levels on the logs, otherwise all the efforts that are put into them can easily go in vain. In most interviews about mushroom farming, the respondents determine the process to be a moderate one. Similarly, these mushrooms are planted in spring and produce the fruit in early August in southern regions, while in the mid of August in northern regions. How to Harvest Red Rishi Mushrooms
Ultimately, it goes around six weeks after the growth of the red rishi mushroom to produce mature fruits. Similarly, when a red rishi mushroom is mature, it starts to adopt a dark beige-brown color at its lower portion while still having white fungus underneath it. This is what a fresh and red rishi mushroom appears like. Its fruits look like a kidney or have a fan shape and can be of any size between 1 to 4 inches in thickness. Now that the farmers have the inclination to pluck the mushrooms, they choose the ones with white bellies because upon the late harvesting, or if they start to adopt the brownish color, they start to decay and won't be of any use for medicinal purposes. It all needs a knife to harvest these red rishi mushrooms. During the harvesting stage, it becomes necessary to remove the fungus from the mushrooms. Moreover, this is a plant that loses its best to use time not instantly, but has some gradual rapidity. Therefore, the farmer removes the dust and starts its processing in the factory and makes the deliveries as possible as they can.